Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. It is super early, that's why my voice sounds like this and my hair looks like this. It's um, 5.25 in the morning and I am going to spin class. Don't ask me why I'm doing this because I don't have work today. So I have the whole day off, but um, I did this, today's Friday. I did this a couple of Fridays ago and I got my workout done super early and felt really good for the rest of the day. And I have a couple of things planned today. Nothing too like big, not, no like big events really but um, it just feels good to get it out of the way early. And this spin class is being taught by one of my favorite instructors and there's a lot of people going to it and it usually just like really hypes me up. So yeah, I have them all layered up because it's like 40 something degrees out. And it's actually gonna be 75 though today. So it's actually pretty good um, for a December day and like kind of weird for me because I'm not used to that. But yeah, I'm gonna hop in my car now go to spin class but just wanted to start this vlog off and say hi good morning to you guys hope everyone's having a great week it's friday i am so happy it's friday so yeah fun weekend ahead but i am going to head to spin class and i'll catch up with you guys after Good morning, I am back from spin class. Oh, oh. You know when you get your nails done and then they grow out and then they start to lift just the slightest bit so that when you run your fingers through your hair, it like catches your hair and it is like, for whatever reason, so annoying. Like one of the worst things. But anyways, I am freshly showered, came home from spin class and I talked to Riley for a little bit before he headed off to work for the morning. And I just, um, am about to make some coffee, make some breakfast. I think for breakfast, I'm going to have eggs and spinach, probably three eggs because I'm trying to up my protein intake because I just don't think I eat enough of it. And I'm like, I'll eat hearty meals throughout the day, but I don't have enough protein in them. And I think it leaves me feeling pretty hungry, even though I'm like eating a substantial amount. So I'm just trying to get like more protein so that it sustains me for longer parts of the day, especially at work because at work, hi, because at work, um, I just don't have much time to eat. So when I do have the time to eat, it's probably really important that I have enough protein so it can sustain me for my 12 hour shifts. So yeah, anyways, I'm excited because I have a facial today and I've never had a facial before. I've been telling myself that I was gonna get one for like the longest time. And I just know that there are so many benefits and it's like recommended that you get one with like the change of every season at minimum. You know, obviously if you're like into that kind of thing. So I'm going to a local place and it's a 60 minute facial i'm very excited there's like a massage included like neck shoulder arm massage massage which i've never had a massage either so that's going to be new for me and i just like this place has really good reviews so very excited to give that a try and i'll take you guys along and let you know how it goes but yeah i'm just like really excited for that i did my normal skincare this morning and i'm not obviously gonna put any makeup on and then I'm gonna go to my facial, that's at 10.30, and it is eight o'clock. So I have a couple hours till that. I think I'm gonna like do morning tidying up kind of things, you know, like the dishwasher. I honestly might vacuum and just kind of straighten up in here and just set myself up for a good day. So that is the plan. <laughs>
life hack with smoothies. If you like chocolate shakes, which I think everyone does, add silk almond milk instead of regular almond milk into your smoothies. And I highly recommend this brand because I've tried other ones. But just add this into your smoothies instead of regular almond milk. And oh my gosh, if you're doing like strawberries, bananas, you know, this is like a sad little smoothie right here, but I'm not done with it yet. But if you're adding like strawberries, bananas, it actually tastes like a banana split or like a dessert shake and it's so good especially if you're adding you know to like vanilla or chocolate protein powder it thickens it up but this in your smoothies is a game changer so just wanted to throw that out there the 9 a.m. <laughs> this 9 a.m. hour is typically her crazy hour and then she's sleepy in the afternoon but Nuna come here Nuna what was that you can tell by her tail being absolutely just like jumpy. Are you a little restless? Someone's a little restless. Oh my gosh, she's crazy. Anyway, I have an idea and I don't know if I'm gonna do it, but it's just an idea, so I'm gonna throw it out there. So it's December 3rd, it's Vlogmas. Lots of people are doing Vlogmas right now and I would love to participate like normal Vlogmas. However, it's just not realistic for me because of my nursing schedule. So I do three to four 12 hour shifts a week. And you know, it's just a lot. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, it's a lot to do 12 hour shifts and there's really nothing to record in the days that I'm doing 12 hours. And you know, I'm just waking up at like 5 a.m. and then I'm out of here at 5.45, home at like 7.30 p.m. and then I'm like shower, eat bed like there's just nothing to show on those days and I obviously can't film anything at work because then I would just like violate HIPAA and then lose my license so that's not gonna happen but I would love to do some kind of vlogmas I guess like my own so I might just try to do like more frequent vlogs maybe like two to three a week and call it like my own vlogmas even though it's not like the 25 videos and like everyone who's doing that total props to you because that's a lot of effort and I feel like people who don't do YouTube don't realize how much effort that is but like go you um anyways I don't think that would be realistic for me so maybe I'm gonna try to do like two to three a week so I actually already have a video today's the third like I said I already have a video that's going up tonight and that's not vlogmas that's just like it was a vlog, like a weekend vlog, like decorating for Christmas, everything, but I'm not really calling it Vlogmas. So maybe I can start, like this one is my first one, so this would be day one on December 3rd. This wouldn't go up till December 4th since I'm already posting a video tonight. And then I have some fun things this weekend that I can definitely record. So yeah, that's my idea. You know, even if I just get like 10 vlogs in there, I feel like that's really good. And I've been super not consistent about posting since my move because... Just like the whole transition of moving from the north to the south and just like settling in my own apartment and starting a new job and like exploring a new area and like trying to meet people just you know wasn't compatible with me vlogging all the time because I really wanted to like immerse myself in the culture and like meet people down here and like you know be out and about so I just wasn't focusing on vlogging but now that I'm settled and I love life down here excuse me and I feel like I have so much to share um maybe I can start back up and I'm feeling freshly motivated since I took such a long time off from doing YouTube consistently when I was doing it consistently last year I absolutely love to do it and it was like one of my favorite things to do so yeah that's my idea and I guess we'll see how it goes so maybe we can just call this like vlogmas one and I've never done it before so that's exciting um so yeah welcome to vlogmas I guess <laughs> Okay guys, so hey, I ended up changing because it is like hot outside. I'm like, it is December 3rd and the current temperature is 73 and sunny. Not that I can complain because I know it does get colder here and like next week is going to be in the 50s. However, this is just so weird for me because back home I bet it's like 30 degrees in the middle of the day right now. So yeah, but honestly like it just helps keep my mood up anyway so totally fine with it it's really nice out and yeah I just put like this light um, coat on it's a little Calvin Klein like workout jacket it's actually really nice and I always forget I have it and I have it in pink too and I never wear it because it's like pushed back in the 
part of my closet that I never look at but anyway and then I have this Lulu the Align tank on and it's just in this like purpley-ish pattern and then I have Lulu joggers on my favorite ones the only joggers I have and I need more pairs so maybe one for Christmas but anyways I just got back from my facial I was totally meaning to vlog before my facial but then I kind of got a rush and then I was on my way took the wrong exit on the highway and then I was like yeah now I'm definitely not vlogging because then I was I only ended up being like three minutes late but I wasn't gonna push it and it was so so nice so I was originally supposed to get it yesterday but the woman who was doing it had to reschedule to today so it was a 60 minute facial and it was like the cleanse exfoliate extractions yeah, so I got the microdermabrasion with it. I've never had it before, and I don't even know what it does. So I want to look into it, but, like, it felt cool, and I don't know. My skin just feels really good. She gave me some recommendations. I feel like I'm very glowy. I have, like, a couple um, little bumps from where she did the extractions. However, it's, like, going down already, and I just feel like I have really sensitive skin. Um, but she did, like, cooling, like, a cooling gel mask with, like, cool rocks after, and, like, my skin just felt so good. So, yes. If you've never gotten a facial, I would highly recommend you get a facial. And I'll definitely be doing that probably once every change of the season or twice. But that's like, you know, if I get like a bonus or something. So I am heading to Ulta because I'm going to pick up my mom's, one of my mom's Christmas gifts. And then I'm going to head to Trader Joe's and I have to get a few things there. And yeah, I'll probably catch up with you guys when I get home. guys so it's a little later I just put some eyeshadow and mascara on just to kind of feel like presentable for the day and I just made a peanut butter banana sandwich I finished vacuuming and I'm gonna head to Starbucks because I have some very like random just like email miscellaneous like documents like things to mail and send and type so I'm just gonna go ahead and sit there and do that also start editing this video maybe this ah, I don't know if I'll do I'll start like the beginning of this video and yeah just kind of like make a plan for vlogmas like my version I guess that I'm gonna do and just you know like put it in my calendar and get really organized um, for the weekend so yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, so it's a little bit later. I've just been getting a lot of to-do list type items done on this Friday night. It's super fun. Like, yeah, wicked fun, I know. But um, I've just been doing a lot of things now so that this weekend I don't really have to worry about any of them. And I can just kind of go ahead and enjoy my weekend. Tomorrow night, Riley and I are doing a date night. And it's our one and a half year anniversary. So that's huge. I'm excited. I can't believe... I feel like we just celebrated our one year but yeah we're at one and a half years but known him for much longer than that anyways i am going to be doing vlogmas day two and it's going to be like a get ready with me slash date night and then i'm thinking next week i want to go ahead and throw some more nursing videos in there because i know a lot of you guys love to watch my nursing videos and they just like I don't know seem to be more popular so I'm gonna add a couple of those in vlogmas and I think I'm gonna do like a couple days like in my work life so I work Tuesday Wednesday Thursday and I obviously am not gonna do like a vlog each day because I don't really do anything but I might make like a combination of videos like in the morning and then at night getting ready for the next day like my morning routine and like night before work prep routine and just kind of do a couple of days and then put that all into one video um so you guys can see what my day shift li life oh my gosh i can't speak my day shift life looks like now that i don't do night shift anymore so yeah it's definitely changed and i am so much more of a morning person which is great because i'm a morning person at heart so it's just worked out great and i think that's what i'm gonna do maybe like you know a morning routine type video i want to do a video about my experience so far with moving from massachusetts to south carolina so yeah that is those are some of the videos to look forward to for vlogmas and i'm happy to say that vlogmas day one is done and i'm really excited to be participating in it and i hope that you guys enjoy the videos that i have to put out i'm feeling really creative and i'm really excited to make videos for you guys i'm happy to be back and i'll see you in my next video Thanks so much for watching, guys.